Gulf of Mexico. At 2 p.m., data from an Air Force Reserve Reconnaissance aircraft and the Martinique radar indicate that the center of tropical storm Dorian has reformed farther north near latitude 15.0 north, longitude 62.0 west. Dorian is moving toward the west-northwest near 13 miles per hour, and this motion is expected to continue through tonight, followed by a turn toward the northwest on Wednesday. On the forecast track, the center of Dorian will move across the eastern and northeastern Caribbean Sea during the next few days, passing near or south of Puerto Rico on Wednesday, move near or over eastern Hispaniola Wednesday night, and move north of Hispaniola on Thursday. On Thursday night and Friday, the center of Dorian is forecast to move near the Turks and Caicos and southeastern Bahamas. Maximum sustained winds remain near 50 miles per hour with higher gusts. Slow strengthening is forecast during the next 48 hours, and Dorian is forecast to be near hurricane strength when it moves close to Puerto Rico and eastern Hispaniola. At 11 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, the center of Tropical Depression 6 was located near latitude 31.2 north, latitude 71.2 west. The depression has been drifting northward near 2 miles an hour, 4 kilometers an hour, and little motion is anticipated today. The cyclone should begin to move generally northward and then northeastward on Wednesday with an increase in forward speed. Maximum sustained winds are near 35 miles an hour, 55 kilometers an hour, with higher gusts. Some strengthening is expected, and the cyclone is forecast to become a tropical storm later tonight or on Wednesday. Elsewhere, tropical cyclone formation is not expected during the next five days.